oh, I brought her my piano. I did this. And <laughs> 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 like anything. Ah, <laughs> 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 okay, so maybe. Good. We're back again on Gusto Reaction, and this is Gusto TV Africa. Donny Fesky out here in the building, your old sweet out, no post. And I got with me the one and only Salman, Salman. and you already know it. You know it. I, I know, know it. it. <laughs> Let's get to it. <laughs> I don't, I don't catch you your line, right? right? <laughs> you guys, if you didn't drop a comment on yesterday's video, you should go back and drop a comment actually, or drop a fresh actually, one today. Actually, comments are always required. Right, uh, there, right. there are actually loads of comments on um the whiskey, you know, eat or miss. Actually, yeah, so I saw a couple of you know, comments guys, comments on that one. So you guys, thank you, thank you guys so much for everything you do. Well, there's been something going on in town right now. It's a battle of I'm a piano. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Like, bro, <laughs> I don't uh, know. there's always there's always this trend of you know a particular sound coming to rain and then staying for a while. Oh, wow, yeah, you yeah. know, there was a time there was a pom pom sound. Oh, if I tell you, say I love you, you. Pom -pom. Pom -pom. <laughs> and everything. You no, know, there was you know the um the Zanku time. Everybody was yeah, doing the Zanku, the best vibe. vibe, the street vibe. Right now, it is I'm a piano, and it's going to. Over a year now already, and, I feel and like bro, it's, it's gonna stay. You this think Ama Piano seems to be like the longest genre of music? So like, <laughs> like I just said, I feel like Asa is Afrobeat, like yeah. our own indigenous mm -hmm. Afrobeat. Right, mm -hmm. Ama Piano is here to stay. I mm. mean, I'm here for it full time. Mm. You know, it's, it's what keeps us moving. Is you can do anything. To yeah, the best said. You want to yeah. chill and vibe and just, just hold want your day, drink. Just you want to, you know, you don't do. You want to, you want to do the energy <laughs> you dance. Want anything you want day. to do, man. I'm a piano, and just as much as an artist, if yeah. you want to, you want to rap, you want to freestyle, mm -hmm. you want to just, just do your thing. You can yeah. always do that on an Ama Piano sound. Yeah. yeah. I feel like it's here to stay. What is what is that one thing that like catches you like catches your fancy with Ama Piano? What is it the the shakers? Is it the boom boom boom? Like what is that one element of Ama Piano that I gets think to the you? element of Ama Piano that gets to me is like the fact that once you start listening to it, mm. I don't even have to hear the artist sing. Yeah, just that is is mm. good enough. Instrumentals. Yes, it's good enough. So that 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 rhythm mm. is, is good enough for me mm. so when you now hear the artist now jump on it it's yeah. not like oh extra dope you get dope uh, extra ketchup yeah, <laughs> right so what's what's your all-time favorite my piano song Whew. oh boy Zeno's has to do it for me Zeno's. which which of Zeno's song i, I can't even pick kilo feshi uh kilo feshi uh his latest one to call of duty call of duty is or loving you you know this is uh, yeah let me just say loving you loving love you i keep to, loving uh, you every day he's here to uh you know you know he's like my king of ama piano mm. anyways we know ama piano you know came all the way you know from south, south africa, africa and then we have you know some guys talking right now that oh i brought ama piano i did this and did that <laughs> uh we saw you know mafurisa and, and david going you no know, back and forth with each other and it all started with this particular tweet now the guy said Davido brought Ama Piano from South Africa two years ago and made it a successful genre of genre in Africa and beyond. Whiskey is now happening on the upping on the same genre after Davido made it a successful one. <laughs> and African artists have been benefiting from well, Davido's success, success for over, over 12, twelve years. Well, Do you agree with that's this? That's a Davido's fan right there. Obviously, but. That, by two years, I'm trying to think of the song. Is it Champion Sound? There was there was. No, was was like okay, maybe um, the focalistic, focalistic Kista. Uh, what's Kista on? remix. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Away yeah, 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 yeah. now, so take me probably, away. Probably that was what well, my piano was already. In like yeah, that before yeah. Let's, let's like mm -hmm, that, my mm -hmm. piano. So I don't. But if we go back, yeah. like way, way, way back, back, right? We had songs like um, what songs like Spono Spono then, no. When most of our artists mm. uh, collaborated with the South African producer, them Uru, right? So most of those tracks were yeah, Ama Piano. Yeah. Maybe not evolved Ama Piano like mm -hmm. we're hearing now. Actually. But they were also Ama Piano. So mm. those artists, I can't pinpoint which one came first. Mm. There was like Mafi Kizolo. Yeah, like yeah. Those collabs were a lot of Ama Piano. Bad, small, so yeah, exactly. Like, so there's, there's, there was Run Town and yeah, Uru as yeah. well. So <laughs> a lot of people are trying so to clean looking that. At, looking also. at Ama Piano right now, 
is it which is your favorite ama piano is it the nigerian ama piano which is now nigeria is doing two minutes ama piano <laughs> or the south african ama piano eight minutes six minutes like two minutes of just instrumental house before you know yeah chu, 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 chu. <laughs> okay so maybe because i feel like when i listen to um south african and my piano yeah. it, it originated from there so mm. they have to own it they have to give us like that time you have to take your time to mm. marinate into it they build right it exactly they build up that that this thing yeah but honestly it gets tiring Mm. it gets time like you're listening you're just waiting for okay you're waiting for something to happen and again you've mm. gone one minute in before you get chuk, Right. <laughs> then that takes another again. one minute again before you get, I, <laughs> before you get, so it's like but I like the two minutes one it's like it leaves you wanting more mm. so the next time you're, you're waiting for the next track by mm. either that same artist or somebody yeah. else to just give you that like take for instance like I said Zinuliski earlier yeah. you listen to Zinuliski track like mm. two minutes or three minutes yeah. right but you've not gotten enough mm-hmm. so by the time it drops another one you're, you rush onto it because yeah. you just want more of that mm. so I feel like I prefer Nigerian about piano. All right, looking at this one, uh, a couple of fans do your own work before coming to spit trash. I think the first set of Nigerian song up, up on Amam Piano should be Big Wiz and, and Bonner Boy, Boy songs, on Spoonu. Yeah, know. you mentioned that one. And then Mafik Zolo, you know, felt attacked and he came saying Casba and Mafurisa were the first to put Whiskey and Bonner Boy on Amam Piano song Spoonu. And that was a historical Still. moment three years ago. Research before you tweet. Also, <laughs> it was the first time. Wiz and Bonner jumped on his sm- on the same song together. Let it sing. I think for me, this is Maforiza trying to just um show off that yo, I'm the first person, first person to like that brought oh, whiskey yeah, and Bonner together. together. Yeah, because I was gonna say the only fact in this statement yeah. is the Bonner first time Bonner mm-hmm. and Wiz jumped mm-hmm. on the song together. I was gonna say that was the only fact, but yeah, I feel like he's just trying to because like I said earlier, there's been a lot of I'm yeah, maybe lot. not the evolved one, but there's been a lot. A lot. Of and then David the didn't like this statement because he felt like, oh, every, someone is praising me, and yeah, <laughs> yeah, trying to give the praise to another person, and say you never liked me. Why? I've always been good to you. Anyways, away now. Yeah, do you think this response by David was necessary or was it needed? Okay, um, initially, the first time I saw this tweet, I felt like, why, I felt like the tweet wasn't necessary. Yeah. Right? You should have just kept quiet and like... Or maybe gone another route. Yeah, exactly. Or then, the second time I read it, it was like, he was playing the victim card again. Mm. But I now looked at it again, and I saw that, okay, this is actually personal. Mm. Like, it's something personal, like something might have happened... And it's like, dude, why Backstage. don't you like? Yeah, why oh. don't you like me? I mean, I've I've done enough. I've been good. Like mm-hmm. we know David to be charitable and all that. Yeah, I'm not saying he did something or bought him something. I get but you. like something, there's something personal Must in have this. Happened. Exactly for him to have responded this way. Anyways, my for, uh before Mafixolo's reply, uh Maforiza rather, David's brother came, uh Dewale. My brother put on countless numbers of artists and producers only for some of them to disrespect him. <laughs> There's a reason why he's still up there and Yo, yeah, baby. fell off. Nigga was always fake. Hmm. Should should Adiwale have interfered in this kind of situation? Well, yeah. this just affirms what I just said. Because yeah. for instance, Nigga was always fake. I mean, mm. some, there's a backdoor story, right? mm. something we don't know. Yeah. Right. And saying, uh, put on the counters of artists and producers as well, David Do, like everybody knows yeah. that he's yeah. done it. But he didn't put Maforiza on, no. right? And he hasn't, I don't think they've collaborated on I, any track. I don't track think, I don't think well. so. It's more of Uru, Maforiza. Exa- exactly. So, if, so what is that thing that is pinning the Adelikis mm. right now mm. concerning Maforiza? Anyways, uh, if guys, sorry, if you guys know something that we don't know, please put actually, that, put that actually down there. drop it down below in the comment section. Before we get to um, um, Maforiza's final reply, let's check out you know, some fans coming out to talk not sure this what is about but i'm a piano ad i'm a piano um niniola rather had our piano songs on lockdown okay. as far as 2017 maradona, maradona rora, rora. magun and sika oh maradona yeah but that's that was an ama piano yeah. just uh, that was more those yeah. are house music, house music yeah, yeah but it. um i think there was one i i like i listened to 2018 was ama piano at omoyedu odun okay okay, okay yeah, yeah odun, odun was yeah. Odin was that, 2018. That was pure, yeah, piano, pure from piano. from um, Niniola. Another one saying, okay, now the gas bus tired. The whole battle of Nami first bring up my piano, Nami own my piano. Yes. Okay, Medi okay. came through. <laughs> he said, Nami bring up my piano come Niger and I have 
hours to prove that we started the niger south african collab i don't like saying shit like this but y'all like putting me under the box <laughs> after me was davy like what is Medi looking for why is he choking out in this kind of conversation Okay, you know, it's not every time something comes your way that you can just jump on. Mm. Something comes your way that you can just jump on, mm. right? And maybe he's one of those people that is, is like, kudos to him, he's been a good artist in the yeah. industry, right? But it's not current. Nothing that happens right now relates to him. Mm -hmm. So he, I feel like he saw this as an opportunity to, like, let me just me show down. my relevance, yeah. right? And to actually give him um that that respect or recognition mm -hmm. let me say recognition maybe he is referring to his feature with mafi kizulu yeah the uh, let's get down yeah. yeah yeah so it's like probably maybe that was what he's what thinking. year was that that was like maybe 2017 or okay. 2016 yeah so there about so maybe that that's like the vibe oh, mm. i featured a south african artist let's my song is down. yeah song <laughs> so, was actually not not a bad one you don't know it was ah it was, it was, was a band, that time was it was a banger band. then anyways sorry there was something there yeah he said after me was was david <laughs> <laughs> now you i feel like now this is just probably him trying to be on david's good books mm. Because like you know he was affiliated yeah, with they, they had, you know, they had something so together probably he was trying to be like Anyways, so the Twitter, <laughs> uh, I don't even know what I'll call I him I call right him the now. king of opinions. The king of opinion, right? <laughs> Daniel Rega came for Medi. Medi, you may have brought Ama Piano to Nigeria, but you barely influenced it. No one is discrediting your impact. Celebrate your colleagues who are in the spotlight and are putting Nigeria on the global map with their songs. It is not too late for you to revive, revive your, your career. career Good luck. Wow. Oh. That was Daniel that Rega. was a sort of shade. It's unlike mm. unlike something that we like to just give you accolades. Then we just did, enter uh, you again. But well, anyways, peace, Peter of you know peace Square for the last line of Medi for putting me under, under the, the box. box. I think somebody trolled him in. in could you go back? Yeah, he said, now why peace can make you sit on top of the elevator room? <laughs> yes. And then maybe they are more seen and then like, okay, let's just catch on cruise. Cruise, right. Then sorry. Sorry, that for you. That, this was just pure whining. Like, <laughs> they just, they whine out. Maybe we'll be regretting that. Like, oh my God. Why, why I put that line? Why, <laughs> why I put that line? Eh? See what Anyway, hala. catch a cruise, man. I, see, I beg for you. See what Anyways, let's get to, um, Chike also jumped on that one. He said, On the Moon is the best of my piano songs are right now. Well, I think this is like one of the songs of, of his album. Stuff. Definitely. When when something's happened, everyone jumps, jumps on, on it. Publicity you know, publicity Peruzzi stuff. also came to say his own. I mean, bring. Uh, and then <laughs> Daniel Rega attacked him. And then he said, <laughs> hey, I trust your mouth this man. Like, bro. <laughs> 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 a, lot, a, lot, a lot of things, you know. Apple and then Dami Twitch are uh, the videos guy saying Nami first shoot I'm a oh, piano video. video. He was referring to the Kista, you know, video. Okay, the yeah, one, yeah, the okay. he, he actually shot that one, yeah. so we can see eh, to some really extent. Different. He's right. Uh Mafurisa finally came out to say, I'm not fighting with you at all, my brother. I'm just adding to the Ama Piano story because it is a big story, actually, with many players. Also, this is a historical moment for SA. We've never had a general blow like this all love one africa respect you big time you did a lot for the culture is this now maforisa trying to maybe indirectly beg the video not to be angry for what he said yes i i believe so mm. i believe so it's like some kind okay i'm sorry i wasn't trying to throw shades at you yeah i was just trying to put my own stuff out there mm. like oh this is what i've done and this is when i did it and mm. who i did it mm. but it was not supposed to be shots fired at you mm. so him saying i respect what you did for the culture and all that yeah as if you i'm not fighting with you there's still something behind <laughs> because it's like i beg don't air my dirty laundry mm. outside so mm. now looking at you know the amapiano influence you talk south africa and nigeria who actually made amapiano more popular like outside of south africa Af to you know to the world this is, is that, that's, it's us now mm. we, we. <laughs> like which which of our artists because we know artists okay, that jumped on um, it we had at some point burner boy was also on some of my piano songs songba remix the jerusalem uh, with um those guys master kg, master KG the, yeah it's davido 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 of an focalistic focalistic i think that was the biggest actually that was the biggest and that was like pure genuine undiluted mm. amma piano mm. so the focalistic one with jerusalem was a little bit house yeah. music vibe 
Yeah. Before Sumba, yeah. and Sumba is just this mm-hmm. year. It's Sumba recent. Is, it's very yeah. recent. So mm. I would say it's Davido. So Davido, the king of of my piano in Nigeria. Give me, give me the title. <laughs> Anyways, uh, looking at Davido, uh, let's just like say influenced. Influence, yeah, yeah, influence. like the influencer of my piano, of piano to the right. world. Right, I'm still doing that. It is it actually has an amazing still, relationship still doing that. Guy, let us know what you think. Who actually influenced my piano to the world? We know it's a genre in South Africa, but right. Right now, Amapiano is outside of Africa right now, going to the world. Who do you think uh, influenced do? Amapiano? And <laughs> share your thoughts down below. Between Davido and Maforisa, who is actually right, who is wrong, we'll catch you Spon-a-lo on the very, very next one. Bye, guys. I-